Hello everyone, and welcome back to another part of Let's Play Twilight Princess. My name is Howell, and let's get started. In the last episode, we killed some Poes, got a couple bugs, gave to charity, heard about Minna, where she's really from, and on our way to the Gurdu Desert. In this episode, we're gonna do some deserting things and try not to get eaten by these little annoying things. But yeah, anyway, there's a couple bugs out here. Shocking. And they're a little, they're not difficult to find, but because of the heat waves, like, the sh it's kind of hard to see the sparklies. But if we just keep running in this direction, we'll eventually, oh, that one hit me. Oh, we'll just find one eventually. Yeah, I think that's one right up here, actually. Unless my eyes deceive me. No, it's right there. Aha, hello, buggy. Oh, come here, little buggy. Grab it, quickly. Cool, you got a day fly. There's another one over here. You need to watch out because there's these giant crevices. And some of them are black holes like this one. Just kind of run around them. Or you can use your claw shot and uh, claw shot your way up into one of those pea heat things, I think they're called. Anyway, those floating things. Which is obviously a lot easier to do it that way. But some of these over here. I want to say this one that has the bug in it? I want to say, maybe? No. No, it's not. Okay. That is cool. Let's just wander over here anyway because, look. Does that look familiar? It should. So let's do this real quick. Claw shot up to this peahit looking tree. And then claw shot up again to that one. He will take us over here like a nice thing. Yeah? Okay. Oh, that was really close actually. Okay. Let's come over here and oh my gosh, we haven't seen these people in quite a while, have we? No, we haven't. But it's pretty awesome because we now have a warping point in and out of the Gurdu Desert without having to do the Oasis fight, which would surely cost us monies. And we're cheap and give to charity instead of using it for our own good. So come here. Come here, little buddy. This is gonna be interesting. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now, come on. Ha ah. ha. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was really close. Oh, I thought I was gonna have to do that again. But I didn't, so that's okay. Awesome. So yeah. Uh, very first time I played this game, I did not notice this very large and very obvious white bridge piece from way back there. Even when I got close, just didn't even notice it. So it took me until nearly the end of the game to find my way over here. And oh, no, I lied! I lied! No! I lied, Minda! Oh, shoot, did not, oh. It's not where I wanted to bring it. I suppose I could have watched her do that, but. Shoot. Well, there's just nowhere for us to bring that. No, this isn't the right place. Get serious, do it over. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got just so excited. It goes here. Oh, uh, that's where... The bridge disappeared, right? It was fallen to the gorge. Oh my god, what? Oh. Let's go here. It's just a big issue. Just a big issue. So I guess she didn't bring that up with us. Oh. Can't you just leave it like suspended in twilight space or something? Let's try this over. Let's warp it to the correct location. Thank you. Oi. I guess now we'll watch the scene. Want to lift it up like a boss. Look at her go. What tiny little arms in the big hair hand thing. Oh yeah, there we go. We um gonna bring this over to the bridge. Get all done. So now we have that bridge safe together again. Okay, so I don't really know what happened there. It looks like she's trying to sit on him, except not. And, ah, whatever. Whatever, it's okay. It's okay, because we have our bridge back. And like I was saying, we can now get across through here again. We can warp out of the Gerudo 
new desert. We can warp to it. And all is fancy in the world once more. Yeah. Okay. So I'd really like for it to be nighttime. So I think what we're gonna do really quick is just kind of do some stuff. Like this is a buggy over there. So I I think I should be able to cut up here from there. Yeah, I'd really like it to be nighttime for when we do this because I feel like the next step in the Gurudu Desert is just like 20 times more awesome if you do it at night than if you do it during the daytime. So I think we're just gonna run around and do some questy things for a little bit until it gets to be nighttime. Where'd my bug go? Where'd my bug go? Is that still up on the wall that I just totally Oh, it's right there. <gasps> Hi, little buggy. Peek up. Yay, it's a phasmid. Cool. So I suppose there's something that we can do up there. I guess I might have been able to it. I don't remember. If I need another item for later. So we're just gonna leave that part for a little bit later. And go over here. Because there's actually four bugs that we can get here, believe it or not. So... I suppose I'll probably just skip around and be like, Oh look, here's a bug, here's not a bug, here's another bug, here's not a bug. And there's that guy. We're not going to pay him attention right now. Or maybe we should pay him a little bit of attention. I think he could shoot me there. I shot- No, I shot you first! Haha. <laughs> also, we should probably deal with these people. Maybe. Oh my gosh, I just wanted to get the bug. Just wanted to get the bug. But I guess we can do some boar riding, so... Boar riding. Oops, sorry. Stop it, all of you. Just stop, all of you. Just just stop. Oh my goodness. No, 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 go away. Sorry, boars. Sorry, boars. No! Bad boars. No, 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 I don't want... Oh my goodness. I'm having issues. Haha, <laughs> okay. I just want this bug right here. Just want this other phasmid, please. Okay, cool. Got the phasmid. So we're gonna go find the other bug, and I will see you guys in a moment when I find it. They're in the field. They're grasshoppers to see, no? Mwahaha. I see you! <gasps> yeah, you are! Grasshopper number one. Ha! Ah, no, no, no. No, no, no. Come back here, buddy. Come back here. No, buddy. Come on, buddy. Hey, buddy. Come here. <gasps> No, 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 You go away. No one wants you around. I just want my little buggy friend. Sneaky Lee, catch up. Yay, got the grasshopper. Okay, where's our boar friend? So now we have to go to the other side. I know it's gonna be dark soon, so we gotta hurry. Hurry to the other side. Took a little bit longer than I thought. Ah! I see you! Oh, you're right there! Ah, I see you! Okay. Don't scare him! Don't scare him! Stop, stop, stop! Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Let's see mount real quick. Hello, little buggy friend. Hello. <gasps> Hello. No, 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 no. Shh, shh, shh. Shh. No, it's okay. Shh. Just calm down. Just calm down, little buggy friend. I'm gonna just peek you up and be fine. <gasps> yes! Okay. Got him. Okay. So let's work back to the Gerudo Desert real quick. Ah, ha, ha. Good. Now it's dark outside. We can do this. We could do some Poe hunting in the Gerudo Desert, but I'm going to save that for later. Because I'd like to hurry up and get along with some of the stuff. Some of the stuff. <gasps> okay. <gasps> There's a bug over here that we missed. Shoot. He's down here, I think. There's that one. He's right down here. Let's do it real quick. Real quick. I know it's right down here. I think. What? No. Did I miss that one? Is this the one I came out of? I think it is. Maybe it's this one. Oh my gosh. I know. Oh, it's right there. See, it's right there. You can get it. Get it real quick. Okay. Awesome. It's right there. I'm gonna say it's dark long enough. We can totally get the stuff done. It's not no, 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 no. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. Okay. Cool. Okay, so let's go over here. Because there's some stuff we need to do. Turn into a wolf, it'll go faster. 
Okay. So run over here. And go hide up over here. And do a little sharpshooting real quick. Okay. And actually, actually, no, no. We're gonna go to this part. I know I'm just being picky right now, but this is a little bit closer over here. Sort of. Okay. So let's transform into a human. And we're gonna use our Hawkeye. It's gonna be cool. Zoom in. And shoot him. Ha <laughs> ha! See, look how much more fun this is at nighttime. Makes you seem like a sniper. Like, like, gasp. Like, what's going on? Don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. Can I kill him too? No. Okay. He is right there. So, ha. Cool. That's all we really need. I suppose there's that guy to worry about too. Oh my lord. Oh gosh. Okay, that's great. Get you right now. And you can see, like, there's a couple things you can break around here, and there's some treasure chests hidden around here. Like, I'm pretty sure under this one, there's one. Yeah. Like, just bust through this stuff. You can bust through them and get treasure chests, but I'm not really interested in them right now. I'm more so interested in going over here and getting along with this. Just kind of do here and run into the wall, and you'll just do that. It's not a big deal. It's not like it hurts you or anything. But yeah. So, hop up here. I think there's anything over here? Might just be a chest. Yeah, there's just a chest. I don't really know what's in it. What is it? Arrows! Well, that's gonna be helpful for this next part. But what I'm interested in is transform yourself into a wolf and hustle over here. Oh, there's a doggy right there. We'll be him in a moment. This is what I wanted. There's these things everywhere. Also, which makes for this to be really annoying. But hopefully get it. Okay. Haha. -ha. Awesome. Okay, just just run away from these things because they're really annoying. And that actually went a lot smoother than it normally does. So yeah, let's just talk to him now. Hello, friend. Right, you're my friend. Awesome. Okay. again. At last, the skills I have to teach you have entered the realm of true secrecy. They are forgotten ways that do not leave our bloodline. Among the techniques I shall be teaching you are some that may even endanger you. Do you feel ready to learn these skills? I do, sir. Very well. But before we begin, I must test you to ensure that you have mastered the last skill I taught you, the helm splitter. Now then, come at me. Boop! Aha! Staff! Excellent. Mm -hmm. Excellent. It appears that you're certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well. My fifth hidden skill is the mortal draw. Let it be hewn into your mind. I like this one. This one's pretty epic. Not gonna lie. Hidden skill. Mortal draw. The ways of the sword are known to many creatures, and some have strengthened their guards against shield attacks and back slices. Should you encounter such a foe, the mortal draw I am about to teach you is the most effective. You must sheathe your sword and cast aside the most basic of skills, the L target. You must wait until your foe is upon you. Then, before your enemy can see through your ruse, you must quickly draw your blade with A. <laughs> there is no defense for this. The mortal draw deals death. Very well. Now try it. Ha ha ha! It's gonna be draw time. Put to it. Three, two, one. Twa! I don't know why I said twa. Hmm, that was a pointed strike, but do not forget that this technique leaves your life at risk. The fifth hidden skill, the mortal draw, has been passed on. Yeah, yeah buddy. I understand, sir. You learn the fifth hidden skill, the mortal draw. Sheath your blade and await your foe without L targeting and strike. There are still two hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training between now and the next time you come or the time you come to learn the next. May we meet again. We will, sir. We will meet again. <laughs> I 
promise. I promise, man. Okay, this way? Why did I come here? I know, it's obviously pointed here. But whatever. It's time to be sneaky! <laughs> I love being sneaky! Which is actually pretty great that we have this right before, or after, maybe after, around the same time as I start up my Skyrim LP. You know, when to be all sneaky and shiz. But yeah. Oh, why do you do that, Link? Why you, why you do that? But anyway, I'm just gonna come over here and be sneaky. Ha ha ha. Okay. So you can even come over here and like get on these boxes and peek through here, which is kind of cool. No, 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 no. Shh, shh, shh. Don't do that. No, no. It's okay. Ha ha. He. He. That was fun. I actually know about these ones for a while, so it's kind of fun now. No, why are you doing that? Stop it. Just stop it. Anyways, let's come over here. Put away your sword. Side step, side step. Steady, 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 side step. There's gotta be someone. Ah, you. Hello, sir. Well, see, this is what I'm talking. Oh, you're right there. Hello. You did not see me. Oh. Like, this, this isn't as fun if you're not being sneaky. Oops. It, that, it's not fun if you're not being sneaky. But I just think this is more fun at nighttime because you get to sneak around like a boss. You can be sneaky at night. And it just makes the atmosphere so much cooler, you know? Maybe it's just me being a nerd. Oops. Haha, <laughs> okay. What else is around here? Hmm. Have you guys ever played Link's Crossbow Adventure? That kind of really awesome game. Hello. No, 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 no. Shh. What was. I don't even notice what happened there. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, that sneaky thing just went out the roof. See, this is what's gonna happen. This is what is going to happen. Is there? Oh, there's one right there. Where did you come from? I don't know where he came from, not gonna lie. But whatever. Not important at all. Anyway, thanks crossbow hunter. Oops. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're going down. Not like there's anyone really for him to call anyway. But I mean if there's a lot of them, like they'll all just come and ambush you and then it's just a murdersaurus attack. But it doesn't really matter, honestly. And I'm pretty sure I murdered most of them. Except for you. You did not come and call for. Stupid bitch. Okay. Well he has a key. Which is what we need. Yeah, as you'll see, we can do the mortal draw on this thing. Oops. That didn't work. Let's do the mortal draw. Why? No. I want to do the mortal draw and be epic. Okay, mortal draw. And lo and behold, the hot piece comes out. So that's pretty cool. If you ask me. Okay, yeah, let's try this again for the third time. Link's crossbow adventure is super fun. And this has always been like... Like, there's various levels where you get to shoot stuff, and this, the one that's, like, based off of this area is always my favorite one. Who knows, maybe I'll LP that one in the future sometime. It's... It, I don't want to say cutesy, but oh my goodness, what's happening? But it's definitely not, like, a for serious game. It's totally fun to play with your friends. So much fun. Go invest in it right now. We Zapper. It's always fun. Just do it. What is this? Oh my god, there's eyes. Oh, it's like it's really creepy. Ah, it's that guy. And he's... He, oh my goodness, he is out for revenge this time. Let's try the mortal draw on him. Ha ha, ha ha, sir. Ha ha, stab you. This is gonna be over in like two seconds. Oh my goodness, okay. You don't murder me first. No. No, sir, I'm going to be winning this battle. Thank you very much. I will be winning this one. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Well, that was... Just like two seconds of fighting. Oh, he's still alive. Are you coming back for round two? No, no, his shoulders. How did I hurt your shoulder? Oh, he, he yelled at me. But... I didn't even do anything to your shoulder, buddy. 
Maybe he dislocated it swinging that around and when he bashed me last time. Oh my goodness, there's fire. It seems oddly deja vu-esque, if you ask me. Remember the, the time when we accidentally lit Barnes' bo bomb supply storehouse on fire? Yeah, it reminds me of that. Although I don't think anything really blows up. But I don't know. Whatever. Just get little boar friend here and go through here. And I'll just bash it all down. Yep. And that's that. NBD. As long as you keep y'all cool and don't panic. Don't panic. Oh my goodness, this place. Alright. So I want to do this real quick. Oh, hold on. We're gonna go back there really quick. Real quick. Real super duper quick. Cause there's one thing I want to check out now that we have sufficiently beat the guy and he burned that area down. There's a post hole over there. And it's nighttime. And then if we do that, we won't really have to come back here. Hello. Hello. Ha ah. ha. It's really dark. I am slightly disoriented. But it's no big deal, because we got the post, so. Okay. Let's go back to Arbiter Browns. Arbiter blah blah blah. Arbiter Grounds is what I was saying. Yeah, let's just head on over here. Hello, little boyfriend. I think over here. Because there's another pose Yay! Look at all these pose. So many pose everywhere. Oh my goodness. You got the pose so Awesome. I almost feel like going and collecting a bunch of pose from out in the desert. But I don't think I'll do it. I'll save that for later. What I'm interested in right now is this. And this right here. Door there, actually. Yay! Okay. Open, please. 50 rupees. Fun times for everyone. So let's head on inside, shall we? Just check it out real quick. What is this place? Full of sinking sands. In those things that we saw earlier that were being obnoxious. Yep. Oh, bye bye. So, welcome to Arbiter Grounds. Fun times are had by all in here. But, not for us right now. Haha! -ha. In the next part, we will start our quest to make it through here. So, ah, uh, hello. Go away. Me. What's he doing over there in the corner? Let's just pull him out real quick. Ha ha. Peace deck. Yay! That's that thing. And there he goes. So yeah. In the next video, we will start our way through here. So. Oh no, sneezing. Oh no. Okay. Well, in the next part, we will continue our quest and make our way through here. So until then, I'll see you guys all later. Ta-ta, bye-bye.